I've been playing the game since like 1999 when it wow. came out. I first saw it at uh, Disneyland. Figured uh, I'd step on it and take a try. And then ever since then I got hooked, so. With my friend, he told me about this cool game where you step on the arrows at a certain time. And I was like, okay, well, let's just go to the arcade. I'll play a fighting game or something. I saw him play it. I laughed so hard. I laughed so hard watching him jump and jump and jump. I do, do the first time stuff. I saw the game, I thought it was the biggest piece of shit joke game like there ever was. <laughs> then he told me about people who do spins. So he did the spins on the song Butterfly. He did the spins and I laughed even harder. <laughs> And I'm like, what? Like my friends told me about it, and, and they're like, and they're like, you gotta play. I'm like, man, this this thing's a joke. I'm like, what the hell are you talking about? Yeah, I laughed so hard that day. The next time we went, I tried it, and I've been playing it ever since. Basically, the when board. this whole thing started quite a few years ago, maybe like 1999, um, people just started, you know, playing it a lot more. They wanted to learn a lot more, so they would, you know, create a message board. When I first started. Um, Masa, actually I think his real name is Masafumi Ino, he sees this and I butchered his name, I'm sorry. But uh, he ran something called The Board where everybody first started talking, it was a message board, a BBS. Really kind of how it is, is DDR Freak is kind of like the United Nations of DDR. <laughs> I mean, everyone's on there, everyone's talking, everyone's usually arguing and being bitter about something, but everyone's there. So if you want to get something across, you post on DDR Freak and the word gets out to everyone. I wanted to know whether or not there's other people, you know, maybe in this in my area that are like me, people that have similar interests. So I decided to do a search online. You know, from then on, I was just like, all right, you know, I'll join in the, you know, join the the community, see what's up, and talk with them, and post questions, post answers if I have any, and it just started from there. And then I've been, I've basically been on the DDR Freak site since. There's people that were not only like me, but then some. Is it going? Yeah. Alright, cool. Okay, uh, my name is Tyler. I normally play here at University Dragon's Lair, sometimes at Harupa Dragon's Lair. Uh, it seems like there's a cap in like how good people are getting. Like They can only get to such a degree like of greatness in their playing ability to where everybody soon is going to catch up to that level if they continue to play. Basically just practice, come down to the arcade once, twice, three times a week. Or if you work in an arcade like myself, you just basically play when you're working. I'm not supposed to do that, but uh. Are you ready?